Over 5 billion naira is proposed as final dividend for the 2017 business year, bringing total payout to 11.05 billion naira. Are all shareholders voting in support of the motion, please raise your hands. Based on the vote, I hereby confirm that the vote to the resolution is carried. Thank you. Directors recall the negative impact the cut in oil price in 2016 and 2017 had on the company through a struggling economy. They are, however, impressed at the level of growth. As the year progressed in 2016, with the increasing uh, oil price, increased foreign exchange uh, distribution, the opening of a new foreign exchange for importers and exporters, a new window by CBN, businesses grew and our company was able to take advantage of that, that we grew our profit after tax by 39%, so we are very proud of that. And if the government continues in the current economic policy, uh, inflation is going down, uh, foreign direct investment is continuing, uh, if we don't have any shock in the system, oil price is improving, so we can see uh, the business growing continuously as our plan is. Uh, the total return to a shareholder is the is the appreciation in the stock in the stock as well as the cash dividend paid clearly we have been one of the best performing from market indices so i think the shareholders are very very happy as as you saw from the meeting uh, going forward we also got the opportunity to explain to them our dividend policy and i got the sense that they understood what the policy is what they should expect so that they will be able to plan going forward with a profit after tax growth of 69.6% and a net interest income increase of 44.5% in 2017, Stambic IBTC Holdings PLC is projecting a better financial year end 2018.